Hey everybody! I'm Michael Gray, also known as Argolfumpf, and I'm going to be playing Bridge to Another World, Escape from Oz. So I'm kind of excited for this game. I like the Bridge uh, to Another World series, and I love the Oz books. I, I read all of the Oz books when I was uh, a kid growing up. I even read some of the, uh, the Oz books which weren't written by the original author, so... I'm, I'm excited for this game. It's got two different things I really like. So, there's a tornado inside a snow globe. It's clearly attacking the Emerald City. And that's our introduction to the game. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so... Let's get started with the game. <laughs> that's such a cute dog. That's got to be Toto. Cute dog. Oh, Toto's cute. Okay, so we've got four modes. We have a Scarecrow mode. A Tin Man mode. Nice beard, dude. A Lion mode. Ooh, that looks kind of scary. And uh, Toto. Okay, we're playing on Toto mode because Toto is totally awesome. Such a cute dog. Bye, kids. Don't be late for school. Shh, Toto, go back to napping. Good morning, Kansas. Rise and shine. Today's forecast promises sunny skies. This is awesome music, actually. I kind of like this song. Get to hear the full song at some point. The yellow brick road's just begun, and this looks awful. We're gonna be done. For. Is that a tornado? Toto, come here quick! It's a twister! It's a twister! Auntie M, it's a twister! Oh! And there's that snow globe again. Okay, I got hit on the head with a snow globe. My house, it's covered in snow. Where am I? Huh, okay, so I'm I'm trapped in the snow globe or something? Hmm, okay, well find out what happened after the tornado. Well, you know, already I can tell that this this game is not being 100 percent um following the book. Which is okay. I mean it seems interesting enough though, so my kids. What a nightmare. I'm glad the kids already left for school. I hope they're alright. Everything happened so fast. I remember grabbing Toto. Toto! Where is he? Oh no! Toto! We've, we've got to save Toto. Okay, so we've got a grown-up uh, Dorothy Gale. And, uh, she, you know, she has kids. And her house was basically blown to a strange place. That's snowing. Now where's Toto? I need Toto. And it looks like we get Toto tokens if we look around. Yeah. Yeah, I, I really miss Toto whenever he's not here. I'm not sure Toto misses me, though. I, I know Toto misses the rains down in Africa, but I I'm not sure if Toto misses me. Uh, welcome to Kansas. Try not to get killed. Uh, let's see. We've got an oven mitt. And just my luck, the key must have fallen outside somewhere. There's the dog whistle. Okay, can I get the dog whistle? I need to unfreeze the dog whistle so I can find Toto. Gotcha. Okay, so this is a, a relatively simple challenge here. Toto, where are you? Toto. Uh, we need to find a heart, so we need to find three hearts. Okay, sounds good. We need to find three hearts. And on the other side, we need to find three hearts. Let's see, behind the shoe, behind the CD, no. Kansas talks! Unusually warm, autumn anticipated. <laughs> Well, this is a fascinating newspaper, isn't it? <laughs> um, okay. Alright, so uh, I find all the hearts there, and now I can grab this superheated um, hot water... What do you call it? Kettle. Kettle. Okay, I use the hot water to melt the dog whistle so I can get Toto, obviously. Toto! Toto, come here, buddy. Don't worry, I'll help you. Hmm. Okay, 
um, Toto's trapped here. Toto, there's uh, a flashlight. Oh, look, it's a picture of me. Oh, so that's what Dorothy looks like in this game. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, she looks like a Midwestern mom, so uh, I don't really have anything uh, to complain about. Yeah, I don't know. I'm sure if, if this game had come out like 10 years ago, I would be a complainy pants, and I'm like, oh, well, this game is totally not following the book 100%. But I'm actually kind of okay with that now. You know? Um, yeah. So that's a pretty uh, a simple puzzle. What you need to do is get um, those uh, pieces in the, uh, in the four inner spots of, of the uh, puzzle. That's basically how it works. It's a slider puzzle. Get those empty spots in the four inner, inner spots. Okay, yeah. This is sort of how, <laughs> this is sort of how the series works. Uh, you know, they don't 100% copy, you know, the, the original storyline. They, they kind of, um, just just copy a lot of thematic elements, uh, but you know it's interesting uh, what the differences are and interesting what the similarities are. Besides, there's already a super famous movie based off this uh, based off this particular book, so it, it'd be kind of silly if they were just trying to copy you know the movie um, or the book exactly. In any case, I'm I'm long story short, I like the game so far. Let's see, I need to find some wheat, um, I need to find a button, what does the hint say, the button's there, and finally, I give this bone to Toto in order to get a heart with heart from Kansas. Aww, Toto's so cute. Do you need your collar back? Okay, let's fix Toto's collar. Where did Toto go? Toto's here, okay. Put the collar on Toto, now Toto is 100% okay. We send Toto through the door to get the key. Thanks, Toto. You're my friend. Wait, what? Toto? Hey, stop! Bring back my dog! Dude! Did you just steal my dog for no reason, you jerk? Come on! I've got chase after this guy. Don't steal my dog! Where is the guy who stole my dog? I don't... I don't know where he is or where I am. Hey, you! Stop! Ah! Oh, dear. Oh, no! Was someone crushed by my cabinet? Oh, no! My cabinet murdered someone! Oh, that's really awful. Okay, I've murdered somebody. That's... That's really bad, actually. Where am I? I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. We're in wherever, some weird, strange world. I bet it's Oz. Uh, I mean, I, 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 I bet 50 Toto tokens we're in Oz right now. And uh, let's find all those Toto tokens. Who are you? Who are you? Oh my! What kind of creature is this? looks like some kind of sorceress. It looks like she's dead, and I just stole her shoe. Why did I steal her shoe? I find a dead body, and my first instinct is to rob it? What is going on here, Dorothy? Okay, Scarecrow. Um, Scarecrow, Tin Man. Uh, I'm also looking for a shoe. Let's see, ooh, okay, so it looks like with this hidden object scene, I can move things around. Huh. Ooh, wait, I can kind of see the person who stole Toto. We've got to get Toto back, though. We, we've got to get Toto back. So let's see, where can I put this? Do I put it in here? I do, and that gives me a tornado. Let's see, open up this for a butterfly, it looks like. Let's see, I see a shoe outline there, so... Oh, I click on the shoe outline. I'm looking for a shoe. Okay, let's zoom in on this. The camera took pictures during the tornado. Okay, there's a direction stone. 
there's the sorceress moments before she was crushed to death. But there's the broom. I need to take the broom, I guess. What is in her hand? It's a drawing of some sort of wizard. The Wizard of Oz, perhaps? And this is what the bridge looked like before it was destroyed. I imagine I have to recreate the, the bridge's original conditions. This is a map of Oz. There's the Emerald City. Something thin might be useful here. Something thin. Um, I'm just going to use a hint. Hint says I open up this to get Oz. And this is something thin. It gives me a lion. Ooh, and four rings. Okay, that's going to be the final challenge. Here's a ring. Inspect the glasses. Ah, uh, hi, hello, who are you? Welcome to Oz, stranger. You must be a powerful magician to have summoned a tornado. Ah, uh, that's not exactly how it works, but okay. I am the great and powerful wizard of Oz. I can fulfill any wish for you. But you'll have to take part in my competition in place of the competitor that died, the Sorceress. The wizard's competition, huh? There are three statuettes scattered around Oz. Find each of them and bring them to me in the Emerald City. Then I'll make your wish come true and send you back home. These glasses will help you in your search. Interesting. So there's some sort of magical competition. I need to find three statues and uh, the medallion. That's got to be the medallion right there. Okay. Interesting. Uh, like I said, clearly a different storyline from, uh, you know, the movie or the book. But still kind of interesting. This seems pretty cool.